Well, no snow yet. <laughs> yet is the operative word here, but you can be, you can bet that it's really chilly there at the top of Sunday River this morning as the sun is really trying to peek out beyond the clouds. Ryan, I keep thinking about it. I've got a friend, Jim, who's in Monmouth, and he's out feeding his horses right now. Oh. And I know he's got to be wearing that barn jacket because yes. it is chilly out there this morning. It sure is almost an autumn-like morning, Tori. And by the way, I have to mention, I actually went up to Sunday River on Tuesday uh, and played the golf course. Oh, how Not was it? Not particularly well, yeah, it but doesn't I matter. had a great day. <laughs> I mean, it was a mountainous, well-kept oh, course. So wow. fun to be there in the summer. I'm there all the time in it's the winter. It's a tough course, I understand. So yeah. you're off the hook, I think. Well, thank right? you. I appreciate <laughs> that. And I was glad to get up there in what has been a really wet month. And we are setting records for July rainfall right now in the number two spot in Portland. That's where we'll end up given the month ends today. But in Bangor, number one with more than seven and a half inches of rain. Notice 2009s on this list, by the way. I thought that would be the worst July ever, but turns out this one's been uh, a lot wetter, and at least we've seen some sun between the rain. Temperatures in the mid 50s, very comfortable outside this morning. Big reason for that, the dew point super low in the lower to mid 40s in spots this morning, and that's off the scale refreshing, especially for this time of the year. Now there is already some wind out there this morning, especially up in the mountains and in the northern lakes too. There are some patches of clouds working through southern Maine right now, uh, especially parts of York, Cumberland, and Androscoggin counties. But these clouds should move along, and otherwise today will just be bright and breezy with high pressure overhead. This system is what approaches tomorrow. It brings us more clouds, and then by Monday, we'll see some pretty widespread rain. So for today, it's bright, it's breezy, high temperatures getting into the mid 70s, but that's way below the average high temperature of 80 for this time of the year. Tonight, it remains very comfortable. The low humidity continues, and that allows temperatures to drop down into the lower 50s in most of southern Maine. Lewiston down to 49 for a low tonight, 48 in Bangor and 49 in Rumford. Now tomorrow, we'll start with some sunshine, but I think clouds tend to increase as the day goes along. There may be a shower in the mountains tomorrow, but pretty similar temperatures. We'll have highs that get into the lower 70s along the coast, mid 70s inland. Wind tomorrow comes in out of the south, not as strong, but it is more of a sea breeze compared to today. We'll show you this hour by hour a mix of sunshine and clouds early on, trending toward a mostly sunny sky this afternoon. Tonight we stay mostly clear, a few clouds passing through, but otherwise a very comfortable night. And then tomorrow there's a chance for a few showers during the afternoon in the mountains, but I think that's where most of these showers will stay. The bulk of the state stays dry through the day tomorrow, but this rain gets heavier to our west by tomorrow night, and that heavier rain moves in tomorrow night into Monday. So it looks pretty wet around here again for tomorrow night into Monday as this area of low pressure forms offshore. Then we'll move that out for the middle part of the week. It looks pretty decent Tuesday and Wednesday, uh, partly sunny, still very dry air, low humidity and highs those days. It will be into the 70s. As for rainfall tomorrow night into Monday. Well, first off, this is what could fall during the day tomorrow and notice most of that in the mountains and up north. And then we all get into the rain on Monday, half an inch to an inch and a half or so really scattered. It depends on where exactly those downpours crop up, but some of them could be pretty heavy. Seas today, two to four feet. Small craft advisory is up with that westerly wind It'll be pretty gusty. Bright breezy today, mid 70s, increasing clouds tomorrow with showers late in the day. Heavier rain tomorrow night into Monday, not a washout, but there will be showers and storms around. Looks pretty good though for Tuesday and Wednesday, highs between 75 and 80 with a mix of sunshine and clouds. And then toward the end of the week, Tori, a chance for showers Thursday or Friday, but at this point, neither of those days look like washouts. And if we get lucky, I might be able to remove a shower from one of those days as we get closer to it. Back to you. That would be really nice. We've had plenty, <laughs> plenty, plenty of rain. And All it's right. going to be August, so let's get a break. Let's right? get moving. Let's yeah. just turn the page. Yep. All right. Thank you, Ryan.